this is Omar for Box Nation, and it's the coming out party for Alloys Junior. Um, obviously, Denzel Bentley headlining this Saturday night uh, at your call, but you were the chief support co main event, whatever you want to call it, and you're in a really good fight, Alloys, this time. But this is what you wanted. Yeah, listen, I'm, I'm made for positions like this. Again, it's only it's only been a matter. Of, it was only a matter of time before I got this uh, a shot like this, and I'm I'm embracing the moment. You know, I've worked so hard, so let me enjoy this little moment. Everyone on the British scene, um, in terms of people inside of boxing, have been talking about you. Know how devastating you are. Mm. Um, ben Davidson's gone on record, said you're the hardest puncher that he's taken mm. on the mitts. He's had Tyson Fury, Anthony Joshua, mm. Moses Atalma, Fabio Wardley. I can go on and on and on. Mm. You're just a cruiserweight at this point. Potentially going to move to heavyweight one mm. day. But yeah, it's exciting times. Get on the on the on the on the train, the hype train for Alois Junior. Yeah, um, all, all the people that don't know me. Just check me out, watch on Saturday. And um, guys, man, I'm going to perform. I'm going to give you guys knockouts. Would you say you're one of the most devastating fighters on the scene? Alan? Oh, absolutely. Eyes closed. I know, like, night and day. Like, look, I'm explosive. I'm dangerous. When I go in the ring and, I, and you get me in them tenances, I'm a different man. I'm not the cuddly bear here. I'm a monstrous animal on, on fight night. Where does that power come from? I would say innate. It's innate. Like, number one, it's genetics, but again, I believe like my mind as well. Like I'm able to be in the present moment and, and get the right shots off. And this fight, you believe you'll actually go a few rounds on Saturday night or not? It could go. It could go in one. I'm going to be very sharp on fight night. So if he makes a mistake in the first fight, in the first round, he's finished. But um, it may go. It may go longer. It may go longer. Talk to me about Ben Davison, the, the performance center Lee Wiley. How much of a an addition has that been to your to your style, everything, your development? As I always say, I give immense appreciation to my teachers. Um, I've improved by Ben Davis and Lee Wiley by 10 or 100 folds. They, they do an amazing job with myself and um, I'm very thankful, very, very thankful. Just out of interest, do you um, train at the same time around Anthony Joshua or not? Yeah. What's that been like? Amazing, man. It's been surreal. I used to look up, to, or I still do look up to Anthony Joshua. Um, as a kid, I used to watch his, his fights. I used to watch his stay humble, stay ready. And it feels surreal. I'm training with the man. I'm, I'm able to ask him questions. I'm able to contact him whenever I, when, whenever I deem to. So again, it feels surreal. Can you reveal one bit of advice he's given you that's really stuck with you? He said something like this. Um, he said, within this boxing scene, it's a, it's a prison sentence. For 10 years, give your complete, utter focus to the sport. And later on, you can chill. A prison sentence. Mm -hmm. A prison sentence, like in terms of your dedication, like you're locked in. There's no going out of prison, you know? You don't have the freedom to come out of prison. So take the freedom now and enjoy later on. Mr. Alloys, we look forward to a brilliant performance yourself on Saturday night, live on TNT Sports. All the Appreciate best, it. we'll catch Thank up you. soon. Thank All you. Best.